Okay, this is an MFJ uh, 464 keyer. A lot of them only had the uh, non-lighted display, and I had to pull the display out, undesolder the band, and take the four little uh, standoffs. They're too short. The new screen is probably a quarter of an inch thicker, so these will not work. You have to have also the standoffs for it. So, anyways, uh, got the uh, got the display put in. Had to. Uh, Add two extra wires here. 15 and 16 were not filled on the original, so I just soldered a couple of wires in there and hot glued them. And uh, uh, C60, they didn't send us this capacitor here, but I went ahead and added one in uh, a 104 and a, a 0.1 uh, on the back side of that board there. And then MFJ did send four uh, little resistors here. R uh, 78, 79, 80, and 81, uh, little, uh, uh, 220, uh, resistors. Anyway, had to put them all in. Can't say as I did the most pretty job. They're about an eighth of a size of a rice seed. So, anyways, they're a little tough to install when you don't really have a setup and it's already been done with a wave machine ahead of you. But, anyways, uh, I did, uh, get the thing together and, uh, <clears throat> And it does work, so uh, we uh, we uh, we got her going. So it's, uh, it's a lot of fun, a lot nicer with that lighted uh, display. So anyway, uh, this is the friend I'm doing it for, uh, N6 GPB. So anyway, lots of fun. Got her done.